Ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? How are you guys doing? I feel like it's been so long. Uh, we're in 2022 now. Uh, Happy New Year. I hope you had a wonderful, wonderful New Year. Hope you guys spent some time with family. Uh, now we're back to the real, real world, so, you know. It'll be good. <laughs> now, 2022, we're starting off the new year. Obviously, there's a whole lot of resolutions flying around, and this basically does mark one year of uh, since I started the YouTube channel, which has been an incredible journey. I can't thank you guys enough. We're kind of going to dive into that a little bit today, get a little uh, little reminiscing going on. And, you know, I mean, we're starting the new year off right with the hood pop. Uh, so this has just had water in it since I built it. I hadn't put coolant in. Uh, it is about 35 degrees right now, uh, so it needs coolant really bad before I left for the new year I did drain the water out of it don't worry uh, but now it's time to put some antifreeze in there because it's gonna get to 19 degrees tonight and I do uh, I do want a driver even though it's gonna be cold so uh, we got to do that we did run into a few minor snafus however so you know part of the new year we've been hitting the gym we've been getting gains uh, when I was tightening down the thermostat housing I, I cracked it yeah I did do that so we had to go get a new one, which is probably a little bit lesser quality, uh, but it'll do the trick. It's also not black. I'm not too, uh, not too upset about that. So we're going to put that on, fill her up with coolant, and it'll be good. I'll, I'll explain more on why this was off in a second. So on these 4.6 liters, one of the tricks to uh, filling it up with coolant is to actually take the upper radiator hose off of here, take the thermostat out, pour it directly into there and that kind of helps it and helps eliminate any like air bubbles that could form at least that's what I've been told that's what I did when I first built the motor and I had no problem so that's what we did now uh, we're not gonna over tighten it this time so we can actually go for a drive now before I left I was very adamant about making sure that I wasn't gonna forget that there wasn't coolant so I left myself some uh, some sticky notes all right well let's see if she'll start It's gonna take a while. We're not even at 150 degrees yet. And I'm getting really cold, so we're just gonna come back to this tomorrow when it might be in like the 40s, maybe even 50s, but tomorrow for sure. So YouTube for an entire year, which is so, so crazy to think about. Uh, over the year we've done 123 videos, I think. And we have, as of today when I'm filming, uh, 655 subscribers. I uh, know I do have to clarify, it's been a little more than a year. Uh, first video, first actual video was actually like September 7th, I think. So when I first started, I thought YouTube was, it's just gonna be me talking to you guys behind the camera. Uh, it, I, it, it is, but at the same time, it was so, so much more than that. And a lot that I didn't actually expect. So when I first made my pretty much my very first YouTube video back in September 7th of 2020, which I don't recommend you watch by the way, I didn't really have a direction on where I wanted to go. I had this dream, this YouTube dream, I had big aspirations, but I wasn't quite sure how to get there yet. Obviously a year later, uh, we're still not quite there yet, but we are working there, we're getting better every single day. It's very hard for me to watch those first videos, they're really cringy. Ah, yeah, I can't do it. In the beginning, I wasn't, I wasn't very comfortable talking to the camera at all, especially in front of people, which is a really hard thing to master. It really just comes down to saying, who cares what people think? That, that's basically the gist of it. So I developed that mindset on who cares if people are staring at me and looking at me when I'm doing that, when I'm filming, and it's translated from YouTube into my life, which I, I never thought that filming videos being a guy behind a camera that looks like an idiot in front of others would have such a big impact on me lo and behold here we are though and it has and it has completely changed my life forever and this is just the beginning of the youtube journey so over the first year we have gotten almost eighty-four thousand views on the channel which is nothing completely like spectacular and amazing but it is still pretty awesome we built it from scratch you know 655 subscribers and we're just climbing every day
YouTube has introduced me to some absolutely incredible people, some of the best people I've ever met, some people I'm very thankful to be able to call my friends now. It has given me opportunities to work with people that I, I never imagined I would. Ford, for instance, I've been able to drive the Bronco, which was incredible. The Mach-E, which was also incredible. And there's so much more that's coming in 2022. It has been an incredible, incredible experience. I bought a car because of YouTube. I built the car because of YouTube, I've wrapped my truck, I got my 91 F-150, I got all of these things because of YouTube, because I have the opportunity to not only you know build it for myself, but share it with you guys, which is by far and away the best opportunity. The feeling of having like a parent come up to me at a car show and say I am a good inspiration to their kids makes everything worthwhile. YouTube is, it's really, really hard. Being consistent is very, very difficult. It's a constant learning process. Editing takes takes hours and it takes so long to learn, but when something like that happens, it, it just makes sense. It's, it's worth it. Now, if one of your goals for 2022 is to start a YouTube channel, uh, the only thing I can say is do it. You won't regret it. It is so, so rewarding. The hardest part, the most important part, is that first video. Just go film a video. Get some content out there and you will work your way up and you will get better. That's the important part. And if you really want to make it, uh, be consistent. Obviously, 655 subs. Can't say we've truly made it yet, but we are, we are well on the path. We have the vision, we have the drive, the goal, and we're going to stick with it until we are living uh, the dream that we have. Like any other social media, YouTube has also taught me that the world is absolutely chocked full of haters. You can't avoid them. Uh, the only thing you can do is not listen to them. Because of those haters, it is so important to be your biggest cheerleader. You have to be in your own corner. Don't be doubting yourself because there is a thousand other people out there online who are gonna do that for you. So be in your own corner. Always support yourself and always have confidence in yourself because if you're confident, you can make something happen. You really can. So 2022, what does 2022 hold? Well, it still holds college for me, which is very, uh, very expensive. Uh, it takes a lot of time, but we did it in 2021. We'll do it again in 2022. Uh, it hopefully, uh, it obviously depends on money. Uh, Mustang is going to be like next level. We already have it in a pretty, pretty good state. Uh, we need body work. We need to fix the bumper. We need to we need to paint the car or plastic it like we've been talking about. Uh, do something to make this thing look really pretty, uh, like like it deserves to be. Depending on how well we're doing, maybe we'll even dive into the suspension and all the uh, performance stuff. Uh, gearing obviously is sitting in the garage, so we just have time. 2022, uh, it's going to be a a good year for the Mustang. If you want some tips or something about YouTube, make sure you ask down in the comments below. I can make a video on that. Obviously, I'm not an expert, but I have. I've worked really hard to uh, to get to where we are today. So at least I know I know something a little bit. We're working on it. The two biggest things, though, the two cardinal rules. Number one, never ever give up. No matter what, no matter what people say, no matter what people do, you can only control you. So never never give up. And secondly, just be a good person. Don't don't do something shady to get views or or don't do something like non moral. Be a good person. If you're a good person and you never give up, I have full faith that something will come your way. So this one year of YouTube has definitely been the best year of my life. It has been so incredible and that is thanks to you guys. You guys have completely changed changed my life for the better and I can't wait uh, to one day I can change y'all's lives. So next time we're probably gonna be doing some more Mustang and truck stuff. We're gonna get back to the regularly scheduled programming. School starting, Jake was gonna be back. We'll have the whole gang together uh, so we can get back to doing some mostly, mostly safe things. I'm gonna leave y'all something a little bit different today at the end, uh, a little quote. If you have the courage to create your own conditions, the rain is just rain. No matter what conditions you're in, no matter what circumstances, you can change it and you can do whatever you want to do and follow your dreams. It just takes courage. So with that, y'all remember, always, always keep it classy. I'm going to go fill the Mustang up with coolant because I drank it all. And uh, until next time, y'all have a good one.